dog? Hey, man. The door's just open? You just I, walk? I don't know. It's just it's like... In? Okay. Oh. Oh. This your drum room? This is my drum room. This is a beautiful drum room. Welcome to the cave, bro. There's drums. Uh, it's a room. It's a drum room. So you want to set up a kit or what? Uh, yeah. I brought my rig. You brought a rig. I mean, you got a lot of drums here. Is that, is that cool? You want to help load my shit? Please. You want me to roadie for you? Yeah, dude. I'm roadie. Let's you. go. Let's go get your you. stuff. Pro gear, pro attitude. This is a lot of stuff, man. You brought a lot of stuff. I guess having cases is what makes you a professional drummer, right? If you have hard cases, you're a professional drummer. This is Ed Songsby's old case. No cool. way! If you want to grab the uh, actual, the, I know there's carpet in here, but... There's more stuff? I, we need our custom carpets. You Most know? people bring a pair of sticks, dude. Hey. You brought yeah, so much you know, stuff. Sorry, I didn't know you had hardware. You didn't tell me you had hardware. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, dude. <laughs> No way, you have a signature rug? Yeah, it's a signature rug. Dude, I've never seen a signature rug. I don't think I have either. And Putting together it, someone's it, kit is so personal. It is. Especially the hardware. The hardware is well, probably the hardest part to put together of someone clear. else's. Oh, can't rope. I spit on it. Is that okay? Yeah, please do it. It needs, it needs a little bit of love. A little remote. Remote guy. This one sounds weird. Yeah. yeah. This is sick. Yeah. Two snares. Two snares. Two hats. You got a pad bro in the middle pad? Pad bro. KD9. Middle pad bro. KD9. Two real snares. I love we should tell them because we keep saying pad bros and I don't think anyone knows what a pad bro is. It only takes two things to be a pad bro. Number one, you gotta play pads. Number two, gotta be a bro. You got any sweet 808s? Kind of, I brought uh, some drinks, man. What, what, kind, what kind of drinks you like? I'm thirsty. You brought a brew zone? You got a brew zone! It comes in its own pelican case. Uh, I, don't, I, I mean, it was a journey today to get you this. You brought going. all this stuff? When did you mean, even this load this in? in? You know, we got a hand grinder just in case you want to get in there with your own beans, you know, get going. Keep that lid on. There's a one two. There's a one two. It's on. Something's oh, burning. Oh. I have, a I have a grinder. You got a grinder? Is it a different? It might be yeah, a different kind of grinder. Wrong grinder, but oh, okay. this, I mean that's for your. Earth. You You're get, incredible, man. I mean, hopefully we don't blow a power circuit with this. But most people bring like sparkling water or like some Jameson yeah. or like the chia seed drink. You know, the little jelly drink. Yeah. The, and the, you brought a rig. You know. You I'm, brought a rig and you brought a rig. On the road, it ties you know your community together. It keeps your front of house happy. Dude, what is this? So this is uh, Ooh. roasted in San Francisco, four barrel coffee, served at wow. our shop in Venice Beach called Manati. Amazing sparkling Guatemalan called El Pilar. A sparkling Guatemalan? Like this is kind of tastes like Rick Ross poured you a whole round of flaming hot Dr. Peppers. That's it's, my it's dream. In, it's incredible. So you're gonna hand grind something. Okay. You know. This so is pour, my first time hand grinding coffee. So pour this guy into this top lid. Or in the, oh shit! Yeah. I broke it. No, you didn't. You're just gonna grind it in there. Okay. Keep Fine. it all in there. Okay, keep it in there. Oh my god, this is so relaxing. Uh -huh. And then now I'm grinding to the right. Yeah. I'm breaking it. I think no, it sounds not. like it's breaking. How many bicep curls are you doing? How in grams? I'm. <laughs> I'm oh, about thirty thousand grams of bicep curl every day. Just kind of. It's like a shake weight. Just get in there with a shake weight. Oh, don't lose the I top. Don't, I lost it. You got me excited with the shake weight. It's like, I know how to use that. So while Elmo does that, I'm going to use a professional guy. Come on! <laughs> oh, <laughs> really? that, no, that's pro too. I feel like I'm Amish. You're there. You're almost there. Dude, I got to say, mine looks, looks more boutique. Like, yeah. Yeah. I mean, more artisan, you know? It's a little more handcrafted, and this one looks a little more size, like. mass, mass ground. Yeah. We have a pelican that we take on the road. You tour with this? Yeah, not all. Well, okay. Yeah. Dude, I want to hire you. Yeah, I'm. I need. Know, we need a two drummer gig. Yeah, I, I mean, I'll roadie and just coffee barista for you too, like, or I play pad. Bros. You're gonna have gigs for days. Pad bros, you know. That's all about the pad bros. So you're from San Francisco originally? I'm from Sacramento originally. Lived in San Francisco. Done a lot for you know country music, for rap music, Big Crit, Freddie Gibbs, some of their early live band oh. shows. 
to Big Sean, to Alice Russell, Old School Soul Sick. singer Durando, a lot with Jesse Boykins. Three, year, three with, years later, here we are. You've been with Banks since like the beginning yeah, of out, out, her out, live touring, right? Yeah, yeah, it's awesome. awesome. Live touring world. The, the Banks and Weekend tours have been amazing. Bonnaroo. Yeah, you guys did Bo but, and Lollapalooza and all that. Yeah, right? I like, love that world, yeah. but I also love small little intimate clubs that are acoustic, you know, just even down to NPR. <laughs> This year we did did Madison Square Garden and That's like dope. Forum, I done, but I, done I have Square never Garden. done Red Rocks. I wanted Red Rocks. Where we at? We doing this? Well, Derek and Banks. This I'm, one's this one's for the homies. You got it. This, this is just a little clean part particles thing. That's here. my that's my Sorry, that's my carpet. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna tear this. We got forty. Two grams of coffee to uh, 600 grams of water. Got a stopwatch running. We're gonna do like a little 60 gram bloom. So then basically our goal is to pour 600 grams of water over the course of four minutes. Oh my God. Even Wait, you're gonna pour for the next four minutes? Uh, I couldn't do this. <laughs> Where's my curate? <laughs> I believe in you, brother! This is gonna taste better than anything yeah. I've ever had. I can tell. I mean, it's gorgeous. Yeah. A little release. You're the most patient drummer ever. I mean, half of the gig is just consistency, patience, you know, camaraderie. This is like, you're doing this with me. We're doing this together. Doing Thank it together. you. Yeah, yeah, you're right. In your head! In your We're ready for it! <laughs> you really went above and beyond. Hey, gotta do it for drum bros Dude, in drum rooms drinking drinks, you know? If you go this far with coffee, you must go this far in your production, in your love with your girl. Like, you're the dude to get, man. Pro gear, pro attitude. I wanna hire you, but I'm a drummer. I don't hire other drummers for drum with me. Well, I'll just come for, hire me for vibes and coffee. You, and you would be an awesome good vibes tech. Yeah, I could do a, I'm, I do a good breakfast bowl, a rice thing. What's a breakfast bowl? It's a little brekkie bowl, got a little rice. Ginger, a little lime mm. zest, you know. I uh, do a shallot, uh, rice, wine, vinegar, olive oil dressing. Are you and, serious? And then we do a little uh, arugula, a little fried egg. This isn't lunch. Poach, no, this fried egg. Fried egg, poach egg, which one ever you want. You, you can egg. poach an egg? Yeah, I can poach egg, man. You're a full blown restaurant. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of like your artisanal catering rig, you know, just for you though. I can't do like 800 people, but you know. I'll, I'll keep, keep it a small gig. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh man, Minotti's coffee. Get you on that. Go to Venice now and visit Minotti's and follow your dreams. I just, you know, I'm very, very thankful to share a bench. I can't even talk, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. This is the first coffee I've had in weeks. I'm about to lose it. Don't poop your pants. Uh, I'm probably, I... Thank you for having me down here. I really appreciate the opportunity, you know, to put some electronic drums together with some acoustic drums. Dude, next time you come, I need to set up my electronic setup too. And yeah. We can just have full pad bro. <laughs> Get the f out. All right. See you later, bro.